They are everywhere, laughing, playing, sometimes only watching in silence. Sometimes they fight for space. They all need, especially, attention. Hey, you want to? Many suffer the consequences of an economy practically stagnant, where more than half of the population live in extreme poverty. And the situation got even worse after the earthquake of 12 January 2010. The greatest natural catastrophe to hit the American continent in its history caused the death of over 220,000 people, including one-third of Haiti's public servants and 102 United Nations staff members. 20 Brazilians were among them. One and a half million people were displaced. The country's relief and reconstruction actions, especially after the earthquake, are part of the effort of the United Nations Stabilization Mission in Haiti, MINUSCA to ensure the security and the development of Haiti working together with the local government. O Brasil tem desempenhado um papel chave uh, e de elevado protagonismo junto à MINUSTA. Há também um elemento que chama a atenção de qualquer estrangeiro que passa pelo Haiti que é a admiração que os haitianos têm pelo Brasil, creio também graças ao futebol. Uh, um esporte que valoriza a colaboração, o espírito da equipe e a disposição de sacrifício para alcançar a vitória. O que o Brasil faz no Haiti é justamente isso. Ou seja, ela colabora com o país e com as Nações Unidas para ajudar o povo haitiano em seu caminho a rumo ao progresso e ao bem-estar. Since 2004, when Minutza was established, the UN and the international community have invested billions of dollars to support Haitian institutions and to repair infrastructure. With the help of the police, a program was established in camps for displaced people to prevent sexual violence. That work helped to improve the complaint process, which resulted in increased medical and psychological support, as well as increased awareness among the population about the severity of the crime. Projects like Light and Security installed light poles with solar panels in Cité Soleil to improve security in the country where electric power is missing and the environment has been extremely degraded. This initiative provides low cost and clean energy and provides a sense of security for people. The Brazilians also coordinate the Peace Market, where 650 Haitians sell handicrafts ensuring income to their families. Brazilian military engineering keeps in the country one plant of grit, gravel and asphalt that supports the activities of the entire peacekeeping force. From January to April, soldiers removed debris, repaired roads, cleaned trenches, and treated a million liters of water. Haiti was on the brink of a civil war in 2004 and today lives in a secure environment. There are still important steps to be taken, like the consolidation of the national police and the respect for human rights, but the climate of stability has been recovered. And with the support of the UN, there was a democratic exchange of power between opponents for the first time in the history of the nation. The presence of the troops is still needed. In the capital, Brazil alone made over 5,000 patrols in the first four months of 2013. Support for Haitian officers is also made by sea. Uruguay, another great troops contributor to the UN, is responsible, among other activities, to patrol the Haitian coast and transport humanitarian aid by river. The safer environment made troop production possible and even enabled the withdrawal in April of 2013 of a Brazilian battalion sent to the country immediately after the earthquake. A decisão de reduzir o contingente é em função das melhorias de condições do país. E um da, dos objetivos agora estabelecidos é o fortalecimento da Polícia Nacional Haitiana.
do aumento do seu efetivo, do aumento da sua especialização, do aumento do seu equipamento, melhoria do seu equipamento. On 29 May, the UN celebrates the International Day of United Nations Peacekeepers, and in 2013, highlights the ability of these professionals to adapt to new challenges. The scenario of stability that Haiti is reaching with UN support still requires much effort. On this path, with the military, there are the UN volunteers like Maguire Buffalo Bill. Apart from working in infrastructure projects, the engineer dedicates part of his free time to young soccer fans. In Haiti, over 9,000 men and women, civilian, military and police from about 50 nationalities serve the UN. They work together for a more fair country where all the Haitians have a decent life and opportunities to build their future. Worldwide, 113,000 people from 116 countries help the United Nations to keep peace.